Yes, welcome to Hengefit Solutions. My name is David Mutbe. Today I'm going to show you how uh, we'll use a stamp server, which is the Apache server, to illustrate an application on event management system. And to run this application, you first thing you ensure that your server is running. Like in my case, you can see uh, my Apache is running, my MySQL is running. I'm going to use my Apache and MySQL as the bucket. So to view the database, you click at admin in my SQL. Once you click there, it opens in your browser and there it goes. So it will open in our browser. So you can see this my database. It has uh, several databases for various project that I'm running from this machine but for today's purpose we are going to measure on event management system so my database is called event DB in event DB you can see the number of tables that we have uh, you can open either of the tables to see uh, the already registered members but uh, uh, this one is not much important maybe I want to show you whether uh, we have any relationships between the databases you come to the design and you can see uh, that some of our uh, databases are uh, very well uh, uh, linked because you can see uh, you can see the relationships are trying to show up there uh, how they are related between which table and which uh, you can see the, the, these other ones have we have not shown any relationships but nonetheless they are related in a way so you can see uh, like this is the primary key is related to another table here and such so we can come back and now uh, I want us to open the system now. You open a new tab, you type the Rocco host because we are running from the Rocco host. Then our system is event management system EIT is. So once you open, it opens there. And now you are able to see the home page of this system. Well, at home page, you are able to see the events that have been handled by various and means of different organizations who have subscribed to uh, this system and here you are able to see or you are able to advertise on tips on how to advertise you can view our contact uh, you can maybe contact us via that link or you can hand an event you can only hand an event if you are a registered member so and there you go so uh, you can you can uh, register here if you are a member you can just log in or if you are not a member you can come and register here and before you register it's good you read our terms and conditions so that you understand uh, what we do so for me because i'm a member i'll just log in first to hand an event so that we can see how we hand events yep there it goes it rocks me in uh, um, my name is my username there is Tesh, you can see. So I will hand an event. I can hand a test event, for instance. I can hand an image, like say that one. Uh, let's say it's, it's a theater we are going to perform, and then uh, we can say for now it's free. We have no special offer where we located in our Taring Road. Yes, now the ring road, however, it's optional and it is today. We can leave it at that. You can say it will start at 10, so it has already begun actually. And it ends tomorrow at what time? Uh, zero, 00 hours. We can hand that event. Yep, so there you see uh, your event or function has successfully been uprooted to now our system. So uh, you being uh, the admin you can come and hand it or you can come and check maybe whether it has actually been and then there it is there has already been handed so you can choose to end it 
uh, the it is assuming we want to hand maybe a uh, money it's no longer free uh, we want to hand some more money that if you are advanced ticket if you are vip you'll pay that vvip you'll pay that special offer we we'll have any mm, can save that yeah event profile changes have been successfully uploaded so and you being a company admin you can also change your password you can manage your password here of course though we are not going to handle that you can edit your company profile here once you finish you can save your changes there and uh, you can again uh, view ticket outlet uh, these are the ticket outlet that you already handed initially for our other events so if they are no longer operational you can choose to delete them or you just leave them as they are so you cannot hand a company profile because you already have one you can only hand it so i can come and edit this my company profile those are the details where i belong uh, which is straight so if it's a number i want them to change if it's an image i want them to change this logo here i can change and then update changes so it has successfully been uploaded so when I come back to a normal member with that home page, you'll be able now to see this event. It's already there. And it shows here again that this is the today's event. So if you click on it, it shows you the today's event only with all the information that is entailed there. So you can come and buy a ticket. But oops, there's no location where you can buy tickets. So let's come to. Uh, this person and hand a location where maybe this ticket can be bought uh, where can it be got it's maybe at Taj Mall maybe Uchumi Taj Mall street is Outer Ring Road we can save that it has been saved now in a normal member person who is a member who is not a member actually can now come if I feel like attending this event I can uh, come and get a ticket if I get a ticket there it opens and uh, I can enter my number name uh, payment mode I should cash and then I can get that ticket so ticket success frame bot now when I click it, it will take me to uh, a place where I can print that ticket you can see it's already there so i can uh, come and say print ticket to print in a pdf i can say yes there it goes and be testing once i save there it saves and that's uh, the ticket bot so from there i'll show you how to log in as uh, the super and mean so in the super admin you enter your username uh, our username here will be Harlow's so it will be the same Harlow's with some additional stuff uh, that one you don't need to know you love yours so once you log in it comes there and uh, as of the super admin you are able to see all the events that have been handled by various super admins uh, at here you have a privilege to delete any event that means if someone registers into your system and hands a malicious event that does not comply with your terms and conditions you can you as the super admin is able to control which event to remain in your system and which event to be deleted from your system and therefore you can delete them here once you click either of the event it will ask you whether you are sure you want to delete so if I say OK, I'll confirm and this will automatically be deleted, but we don't want to delete it now. So mm, these are how these are the registered organizations. You can come and view registered companies. Here they are. You can see their details in, into more details. There the information is. The other one has a lot of information is also there. Uh, so you may choose to delete a certain company from existence from your system you just come and click delete to ask again are you sure you want to confirm delete then if you say yes you delete if you say no for our case it remains 
and again you can view the event uh, that's where we were so you can see this the super admin who is logged in is called our rules uh, and those are some of the uh, use uh, functions of this uh, system and so uh, I'll leave you at that for more information you can always contact me you can for more and on how to get this system I'll still give an access to you and you'll be able to get it and run so otherwise thanks so much for listening thank you thank you